The reviews are in, and critics are suggesting that the new remake of The Crow should have flown right past theaters. The dark superhero film, which stars Bill Skarsgård and the singer FKA Twigs, arrived in theaters on Friday, but reviews were embargoed until around when Thursday night preview screening began, which has come to be seen by Hollywood prognosticators as a marker of studios fearing a poor reception. That turned out to be an accurate prediction, as the film currently has a disappointing 14% rotten rating amid the most prestigious critics surveyed by Rotten Tomatoes. The Crow fares slightly better on Metacritic, which takes into account the strength of pans and praise, but it still only scored 30 out of a possible 100. Skarsgård stars in the remake of the 1994 hit film as Eric, who's murdered alongside his love Shelly, played by FKA Twigs, but is revived with the promise, bringing Shelly back to life if he dispatches the gangster who killed them. The 1994 original was a hit at the box office, but the film was dodged by tragedy after its star Brandon Lee, the son of Bruce Lee, was killed on an on-set accident when a prop gun fired by one of his co-stars malfunctioned. Several critics took to this new version of The Crow to task for focusing more on grim vibes than on the screenplay or acting. Although it wasn't a straight remake, people also didn't find it to be a faithful adaptation of the graphic novel, and instead, it was a strange hybrid. 